Have you ever wondered if there's more to South African history than, well, big men narratives about European countries sailing across the ocean to steal land and resources that were never theirs in the first place? A lot of the time, these big men narratives push other histories aside, and we are left with very little nuanced insight into our past. As peer-reviewed research is left behind a paywall, we are left with issues. One of these issues being that these limited sources only give us smaller bites of a much larger and tastier cake. But there is an even bigger problem where people get their hands on the wrong information and publish and preach this information. These information gaps can give rise to insulting ancient alien theories. If man was created black, if the first man or Adam on earth was black, why is it that Adam evolved from a skin color that was uh, arguably more resistant to the rays of the sun to this feeble little white skin that develops cancer when exposed to the sun. This lack of information can also give rise to strange and creepy nostalgia for the apartheid past. Listen, my friends. Oh my God. No, God! Destroy no, God, please, no, no! These problematic viewpoints and theories plague social media. And that's why it's important to get the right information out there. There are so many different, interesting and rich stories that we can find in the South African past, ranging to before colonialism all the way through to the early 2000s. Some interesting questions about our past include why Afrikaans was actually first written in Arabic? What are the paintings in the Drakensberg? What on earth is Shwe Shwe? Why the Tokolosh was mentioned in various murder trials? Why we cook our sisters? And why, at one time, the Smurfs were deemed satanic? I am Angela Ferreira and welcome to my channel, Gem Squash, where we discuss all things South African history and pop culture, making these tales available to all. My first video is going to be up really soon, so please like and subscribe so you don't miss these tales from the South African past.